Chicken wings. Everybody wants to know about chicken wings. Hussy, can we do chicken wings on the Blackstone griddle? Yes, you can. And I'm gonna show you. It's so easy. Just a few simple ingredients, a few techniques. And I'm gonna show you those techniques in this video. And you're gonna have some beautiful chicken wings for you, your family, your friends, your neighbors, everybody. Everybody who wants a chicken wing can have a chicken wing. Let's get it, y'all. Chicken wings on the Blackstone griddle. All right, let's go. First things first, you gotta dry the wings. So you just wanna come in here with a paper towel. You wanna dry these wings real good. You can set these out the night before also and just uncover it in your fridge and let them dry. Uh, you can do like this. You can uh, just use a paper towel, just kind of dry them off. This is the key to a nice crispy wing, nice exterior. Uh, there's no water. Water is what kind of makes everything kind of steam and not get crunchy, crispy, etc. For this next part, we're gonna glove up. So, what's the suspects? Got a little smoked paprika. Paprika. A little pepper. Black pepper. A little bit of salt. That's it. The tip. A little bit of cornstarch. Cornstarch absorbs moisture. You want a moisture gone. Comes into the cornstarch. Also acts as a little bit of a breading. Win-win situation. There you go, put a little oil down. Just a little bit of, uh, this is avocado oil. And this is just for adhering. Make stuff adhere to it, the salt, pepper. So you wanna be kind of liberal with your salt, okay? Pepper. There we go, pepper. Then the smoked paprika. This gives it another little, just a smoky element. Gives it some color. Uh, you could use your favorite barbecue rub on this as well. You don't have to use what I use. Use whatever you like. You can use a barbecue rub. You can use just salt. You can just use this pepper. A little bit of a cornstarch. This is about a tablespoon, a tablespoon of cornstarch. While we're doing this, let's get our blackstone warmed up. We'll put everything on low. We're just gonna come in here and get our fingers dirty. That's why we got our gloves on. Just wanna come mix this all around. Let them chill out and we're gonna get them on the blackstone. We want the top to be about 350 degrees. You don't wanna go really high because it's gonna take chicken wings a good amount of time to finish cooking. That's probably the most difficult thing for folks is it takes a while, okay? All right guys, so it's time to get our chicken wings down on the blackstone and I'm just gonna add just a little bit of oil, not much. They're gonna release a little bit of, of oil already so I don't wanna add a lot more. There we go. Just gonna come in here, position these dudes. Funny story of why I'm doing this today. I've done chicken wings, it's been a little while back. Guy at work, Tracy, uh, him and I were talking one day at work. He said, Hussey, can you do chicken wings on the Blackstone? I said, yes, you can. I said, I'll tell you what, next couple videos, I am gonna do chicken wings on the Blackstone for you, Tracy. So. This is for you, Tracy. So one thing you wanna do, is you wanna take your cover, barely fit. That just creates a little bit of convection, kinda of like an oven, uh, and it helps things along a little bit better, okay? Guess what? I'm out of gas. Be right back. Ding, 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 ding. Woo! Now we're cooking with gas, <laughs> literally. We're gonna let these go for a couple minutes, gonna flip them, see where they're at, all right? All right, guys, let's see where we're at. On a, I had that on high. Look at there. See that? See that little crust right there? That's what you're after. Well, these things are plump. Y'all, this right here is exactly what you're looking for. Nice and, see that crust right there? It's gonna firm up even more. It's gonna be beautiful. All right, we're gonna corral these up. We'll let these go for another two to three minutes and we're gonna temp them, all right? I wanna put them over here I want to scrape away this fat that's kind of built up right here. You know, 165 is internal temperature, what you're looking for. 165 kills salmonella instantly. 165, and actually higher for chicken wings. So we're at one, we're in the 160s already. We want to get the crust to where we want it so it adheres to the sauce. The sauce. I like Sweet Baby Ray's buffalo wing sauce. So I'm just going to add about a cup, half a cup, half a cup, not a cup. 
Just gonna add a half a cup of it. This right here, I like to add some butter. Butter, fair amount of butter that helps coat. Okay, it's about two tablespoons. And then a little bit of honey, a little bit of honey. Makes it kind of sticky. Mix it well together. Feel free to add what you want or use whatever sauce you want. Make your own sauce. So now our wings, I'm gonna put them back over here. This right here is the perfect one. Look at that, nice and crusty. So we're gonna let them get crusty on this side and then we're gonna toss them in our sauce and we're gonna be eating some chicken wings, y'all. Y'all, these chicken wings are done. Nice color to these. Beautiful color, actually. We're gonna take these and we'll put them in this bowl here. Take our sauce. Yes, drizzle it all over that. All right, I say let's plate these dudes up. Let's give them a try. Got a question for y'all. Got a question. Do you like the drums or the flappers? Asking for a friend. I'm just gonna say flappers. I like flappers personally. I said it and I meant it. But I'm not gonna discriminate. There you got it. Chicken wings on the Blackstone griddle. It's beautiful. I can't wait to sink my teeth in them, but they're hot. I gotta wait. All right, let's give these things a try, y'all. Pretty sure they've cooled off by now. All right, let's give this a try. Mm. Love that buffalo sauce and that honey together. It's that tangy, a little heat, a little sweet. Kind of tastes a little bit of smoky from that smoked paprika. This is a beautiful chicken wing, y'all. Mm. Y'all appreciate you watching. Tracy, thanks for the inspiration fixing chicken wings. Hope you give them a try too for yourself. If you've made it this far, make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, leave me a comment too if you don't mind. And then there's a join button if you wanna see behind the scenes footage, uh, you do little giveaways here and there. Uh, just, just a little bit more stuff, a little bit more interaction, okay? Y'all, I'm done with this video, but hey, check out these other two videos on the sides of this right here. You're gonna love it. Hey, and I'll see you there, all right? Love you, appreciate you. Hunger Hussy is out.